What's up nerds, this week in PC gaming we're exploring a world filled with lots of amphibious pals in time on Frog Island, seeking forgiveness through puzzles in Monument Valley, creating a medieval colony in Clan Folk and trying to find your way out of the lave in Toilet Chronicles. I'm Lauren Aitken and this week the PC stands for Portable Computer. Rejoice! Steam Deck Quarter 3 orders are now being fulfilled and you'll soon be able to get your hands on that new PC console thing you put a deposit down on a year ago. There's sandbox fun, strategy and puzzles to get stuck into this unusually busy week. First up this week is Time on Frog Island, which comes to Steam on July 12th. After finding yourself shipwrecked on a mysterious island, you discover that the only inhabitants are weirdly large frog people. You can befriend the locals and go on quests for them, solve puzzles and learn new skills in this new sandbox adventure. You can fish and farm the land as well as learn new means of traversal around the island as you seek out hidden treasures. You also want to trade items with the frogs to rebuild your ship and get back to a less amphibious civilization. Also coming to Steam on July 12th is Monument Valley. This short but sweet indie puzzler has you embarking on a journey of forgiveness as Ida, the silent princess. You'll need to solve illusionary puzzles by manipulating monuments and create new paths to explore the surreal new world. You can transform the landscape by working with and against the architecture, but be wary of the crow people who will be blocking your way. Frogs and crow people? What's next? Just a regular village sim? Well, yes, actually. Clan Folk releases an early access on July 14th, and you'll be tasked with building a medieval colony set in the Scottish Highlands. You'll have to establish your clan, watch over your livestock and learn to survive in the bitter winters. And trust me, it gets Baltic here in winter. Whether you want to become a new central trading hub or a warm and friendly settlement, you'll need to manage schedules to ensure your clan is well rested and up to the task. Clan members have their own aspirations and skills that will help along the way, so be sure to assign them to the correct task. Oh, and don't forget to teach the younger generation new skills or it's curtains for you. I'm sorry, but this one I just couldn't pass up. In Toilet Chronicles, you're trapped in the lavvy and you'll need to work with your toilet neighbour to escape. It's a slapstick horror kind of game, so don't expect anything too serious. Expect to try and get your head around the new bend of toilet humour and outdated memes as you engage in weird dialogue, cry and solve puzzles. It comes to Steam on July 14th. This Week in PC Gaming is sponsored by The Monksdale Hat. It's no secret that I love cute things, whether that be kittens, babies or little snail creatures you can wear as a hat. In Monster Hunter Rise Sunbreak, if you photograph one of these babies, you can wear one as a little armoured hat. Just what you need. And that does it for this week in PC Gaming. For the hottest news, reviews and takes, head to PCGamer.com. I'm Lauren Aitken and I'll catch you next week. I mean at this point it means anything could be a hat, so here's Eddie, he's an core. he's a hat now. There's so many other things that could be a hat. I could put a cat in my head. Cat hat. That might be a bit more sore because it's got sharp, sharp hands. Mm-hmm.